Hello everyone, it's me, David from David's Dinosaur Diaries. I want to start this video by thanking all of you for all the love and support you have shown this channel. It has been absolutely brilliant. I've loved bringing all these videos to you. We have nearly hit 100,000 views on YouTube. I mean, it's absolutely unbelievable. I never in a million years thought we'd get to that number on this channel. So thank you to everyone who has supported and watched every single video. I'm very, very grateful. But if you haven't subscribed already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification button for all videos that we've got coming out and we've got some special treats coming for you. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I'd be very, very grateful. But enjoy the video. See you in a bit, everyone. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to David's Dinosaur Diaries. And it's time to talk about another dinosaur that's become much more popular lately. It's the dinosaur that's got everyone asking questions, the Therizinosaurus. Therizinosaurus is a dinosaur that has caused a lot of controversy and questions for paleontologists over the years. When they were first discovered, it was believed to be a giant turtle. However, 25 years later, it was identified as a theropod dinosaur. Now, the first thing that people may notice about the Therizinosaurus, and what makes them unique to any other dinosaurs, is that they have massive claws on their arms. In fact, they had the longest claws of not just any dinosaur, but any other land animal on Earth ever. Their claws were three feet long and were very sharp and curved. People may think that these were used for defense and attack. However, they were mainly used to collect vegetation. Despite them looking rather scary, they weren't actually carnivorous. They were herbivores. They lived in the late Cretaceous period around 70 million years ago. These dinos, like many others, were actually covered in feathers rather than scales. The Therizinosaurus weighed around 5 tonnes and was 10 metres in length. They were believed to be fantastic climbers and were able to climb to very good heights. One of the things you will also notice about the Therizinosaurus is that their mouth is shaped very similar to a bird beak meaning they probably would have climbed trees to reach the tastier leaves at the top. The Therizinosaurus has recently become more popular lately as it had a starring role in the new Jurassic World film, Dominion. But that's all we've got time for today, but I will see you soon for another dinosaur and I cannot wait. See you soon everyone, goodbye! <laughs>